Happening this week, local and state leaders are coming together to talk about three proposed efforts on multiple levels to address gun violence. These new policies aim to protect schools from threats and keep guns away from people who aren't allowed to have them. Back in August of 2022, the Pima County Board of Supervisors passed a resolution calling to end the state law that prevents local governments from addressing gun violence, but nothing changed. Months later, Professor Thomas Meixner was killed on the U of A campus in a shooting that some say could have been prevented if Arizona had red flag laws. Pima County supervisors, prosecutors, state lawmakers, and other leaders are now hoping to work together to find local solutions. And I wanted to check on recent legislation that Arizona has made movement on focusing on guns. I found the state records online that show last year the House and Senate passed three bills to end the ban on gun silencers, to have mandatory firearm training in schools and let parents bring guns on campus, and to ban local governments from banning gun shows. Governor Hobbs vetoed all three of them. In her response to the bills about local laws. She said she hopes the state will work with local governments to find the best solutions, which is what this upcoming meeting on Friday hopes to do.